John Hopkins University says more than 12,700 people died of COVID in the U.S. over the last 28 days. But on 60 Minutes on Sunday, President Biden said the pandemic was over. He did say it's still a problem and his administration is doing a lot of work. But then he repeated that it's over. Some health experts say it's not quite that simple. We shouldn't forget that there are still hundreds of people dying each day across America from COVID, but it is true that we're definitely doing better now than we've done in a very long time. I think it's better to say the situation continues to change. That's Dr. Cameron Kaiser, the deputy public health officer of San Diego County. He says that COVID has now shifted to being endemic, meaning the virus is still widespread. The difference, he says, is we have the tools to know how to control it. COVID is not just the flu and never has been. And however you define a pandemic, we're still going to be struggling with it for a long time. But now is not the time to forget the lessons learned. I think a good part of where we are right now is people stepping up. Um, protecting their vulnerable neighbors and co-workers by wearing masks and taking other sensible precautions. He says a big part of that includes being vaccinated and boosted. And until science on this improves, boosters will need to be updated regularly. As we're starting to move towards a more flu shot-like model where we make these small changes over time where people can start treating COVID shots like flu shots and that people can have ongoing protection without having to get sick again. Kaiser says the new booster or bivalent vaccine is available now. Everyone 12 and up is eligible for the Pfizer booster, while those 18 and up can get the Moderna shot. Everybody should get a new one. Um, if you're a kid under 12, you can still get the old booster if you never got one. But whether you got a whole bunch of boosters before, you never received a single booster in your life, you should still get this one. Kaiser says we all have to do our part to keep our community safe. People have thought that endemic means just going back to normal and it's just business as usual. And that's not the case. It just means that it's here to stay. Kaiser says county testing sites are still open, but may shift because they're state funded and more people are testing at home. Kitty Alvarado, KPBS News.